recently, um, there's been a rumor, and I think some of this stemmed out of a, a comment that our current Prime Minister, Christie, made at a function in Freeport, commending you and talking about your history and all the rest of it. And um, some quarters have it to say that you, because you're no longer active in the free national movement, um, is joining the PLP. Is there any truth to that? Abs absolutely not. I'm not joining anybody. Um, my political affiliation uh, has been uh, the free national movement. I continue to, uh, to be a member of the free national movement. But, um, but, my po but I'm not in active politics. I'm not actively involved with politics. I'm not doing anything for the free national movement in politics. I'm not doing anything for the Progressive Liberal Party in politics, the DNA in politics, or anybody else in politics. And so uh, that, that, that's not true. And so the uh, people have also said I was coming back to run for the FNM, and that's not true. That's far from but, true. But the, the, the public, and I have to do this before we go ask this question, because it's on many people's uh, mind. Why is it that uh, young, talented people such as yourself, Darren Cash and others, but we're here with you, so we'll ask you, why is it that you um, gave up your Senate appointment and did not, with all the talents and gifts you have, offer yourself to serve your party and to be more active, involved in I it? I committed these five years of my life to my children's education. I have two young men who are in university and I am funding their education to the extent I can. I have a wife in university, I'm funding her education. And so I committed myself to doing that. That's the only reason, I'm doing something else now. Okay, uh, w before we go, is there any thoughts that you want to share with the country about um, your party, the Free National Movement, as we prepare for the next general no, no, election? No, I'm not speaking for the Free National Movement at all. I'm not involved with active frontline politics. I'm not involved with politics, and, and I'm far from able to speak for the Free National Movement or anybody else. Uh, I, I want to encourage every Bahamian to do what they can to build and nurture themselves, their family, and this country, and to trust God to enable them to do that uh, well enough so that we could become a, a better country. But everything in this country ha doesn't have to be centered around politics. And I can tell you for this time in my life, my life certainly is not. And you're at peace. I'm uh, absolutely at peace with myself. Mr. Lang, you've been an excellent guest. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming and sharing you. your thoughts it. with our viewing public. On behalf of all of us, bringing you nation building, I'd like to thank you for tuning in today and invite you to stay tuned to the next edition of Nation Building when we bring you educational and informative program for you, the viewing audience. Thanks.